Matthew 27, 26. Then release he Barabbas, son of the father, Bar, the Jewish is son of, Abbas, or Abba, father, unto them. So Jesus is kept. Barabbas goes home. That features the Christian. Jesus goes on to the cross and the sinner gets released unto them. And when he had scourged Jesus, that means beat him, whipped him. Somebody's innocent, got whipped. And you're going to cry, baby, as a Christian because somebody mistreated you. And he delivered him to be crucified. So he hasn't, he hasn't even turned over yet. And he's already whipped in front of the pilot. Who professes him to be innocent. No fault. And Christians cry, baby, because why? Then the soldiers of the governor, and the governor would be Pilate, Roman soldiers, we got to get that, took Jesus into the common hall and gathered onto him a whole band of soldiers. They got a whole unit of soldiers together. So there's just more than two. And Roman soldiers are going to start having fun with Jesus. And you had what kind of hard life as a Christian? They stripped him. Now this is important. You got to get this. They stripped him. They took his clothes off him. And put on a scarlet robe. Red. Deep red robe. This robe will be found in churches. Religion. As the symbol and, and, and stretched upon the cross. A red or purple robe on the cross. Including Baptist churches. There it is. The scarlet robe. They made a whole movie about it. Hollywood, religion, and the Baptist. There it is. Let's stop. We'll close up and we'll go home and you can have your popcorn. Okay, there it is. You know I'm going somewhere with this. And when they had plated the crown of thorns, they, 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 they made this thorns into a crown. They weaved it. They sold it. They tied it. They fashioned thorns. Genesis 3, the curse of the earth, the curse of Adam. They purposely took thorns, where they got them, I don't know, and they made a crown. And they put it on his head, and a reed in his right hand, right hand means the power of authority. They bowed the knee before him, mocking him. Hail, King of the Jews. So they're, 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 here is this king with a crown of thorns and a reed. And, a reed's nothing. It bends. They're bowing the knee. Oh, King of the Jews. Oh, King of the Jews. Oh, hail the King of the Jews. While they spit upon him. They took the reed and smote him on the head. They're mocking. They're making fun of. And Christian, you got called what name? That made you give up? When you're in street ministry, street preaching like I do, you, you, all the things that happens to you, all the story. What, 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 you penny waste, what happened to you? They spit upon him, took the reed, and smote him on the head. And it wasn't just a lovely love love tap either. Roman soldiers. I guarantee this group, this band of soldiers. All right, let me have it. It's my turn.
come up with a big honker. And after they had mocked him, made fun of, they took the robe off him. Oh, the scarlet robe 28, they took off of him and put it on his own raiment on him and led him away to crucify. He didn't have that scarlet purple robe, Mr. Baptist Church. Mr. Religion, take that thing off the cross because he didn't carry that robe to the cross. Take it off, Hollywood. No, no, the Baptist church on you because I am Baptist. The Baptist church follows Hollywood, but they don't follow the Bible. So if you walk into a Baptist church and they got that red shroud or whatever you want to call it, they got it on the cross or on the walls, whatever they got, they're wrong. Because they took the robe off. It wasn't his robe. It was a Roman robe. And put on his own raiment, not the, not the scarlet, and led him away to crucify him. So he's on the way to the cross. He's with the cross with his own raiment. We'll learn that much later. As they came out, they found a man of Cyrene. This is an African nation, Libya. Cyrene's in Libya. Simon. Notice the name Simon keeps showing up. Simon means they hear. It's a form of Simeon of the Old Testament. I'm not, I could be wrong in this one, but I think it was Simeon that Joseph put in jail. I think it was. I could be wrong. Simon Peter. Judas, the son of Simon. This is an African man, they say. And they, they chose this African for one reason. To mock Jesus. Jesus is being led by a black man, symbol of servitude. And, and listen, I don't care. You don't, I don't care if you don't like it. And I'm going to do it with a black Here's a servant, here's a slave carrying that man's cross. They found the man, Cyrene, Simon by name, and him they compelled, <laughs> they made him do it, to bear his cross. Hey, you black men over there, get over here, take that cross. And they would, they would say, hey boy, take that cross. You know, like what I said, that's too, too, you can turn off the channel now, you can go home and cry baby in your soup. Okay? It's plain and simple. I'm going to preach the truth. You don't like it? Mark 15. Mark 15. Boy, you changed the subject. I know. 16. Mark 15, 16. And the soldiers led him away into the hall called... Paterodium. Matthew says the common hall. And they called together a whole band. Hey guys, get over here. You want to have some fun? We got a king here. Oh, really? And they clothed him with purple. See, scarlet, purple. Really dark shade of red, purple. So, Scarlet Matthew, purple mark, Baptist church and religion. And played it, me, up the crown of thorns, and put it on his head. And they began to slew. You want to slew? <laughs> Hail, king of the Jews. And they're mocking him. They got him dressed up in a form of a Roman leader, not Jewish. You never found Scarlet on, on David and all that. They smote him on the head with the reed and did spit upon him, bowing their knees, worshiping him. <laughs> Look at that interesting thing Mark said. Oh, hell, the king of the Jews. Hallelujah, king of the Jews. Come and save us, king of the Jews. <laughs> Give me that reed. It's my turn. Come on, Al Lucius. You had it a couple times. My turn. When they had mocked him, they took off the purple from him. 
What are you going to do in your Baptist church when they don't do what, what the Bible says? And put his own clothes on him and led him out to crucify him. And they compelled one Simon, a Cyrenian, African, Libyan nation, who passed by. <laughs> this guy's at the wrong time in the wrong place. Coming out of the country, the father of Alexander. Uh, 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 what? 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 Alexander and Colt? <laughs> Alexander, Egypt? But this is a name now. Pay attention to Alexis. Pay attention to Alexander the Great. Who, who said he was virgin born. He was the father of Alexander and Rufus. That's interesting information. And buried his cross. And they brought him to Golgotha, which is being interpreted the place of the skull. Okay. Luke 23. Luke 23. Verse 26. See, we're going to look at the scriptures. Look at 25. And he released unto him that for sedition and murder and was cast into prison, whom they desired, but delivered Jesus to their will. Going to crucify him. As they led him away, they laid hold on one Simon the Cyrene, coming out of the country. On him they laid the cross that he might bear it after. So here's this man walking down the street or whatever. They take the cross and they put it on him. That's compelled. That is interesting there. John 19. John 19. 16. Look at 15. Compared to last night. Answer away with him. Away with him. Crucify him. Paul says, shall I crucify your king? The chief priest answered, we have no king but Caesar. You know who's going to be the government in the, the, the tribulation period, the great tribulation? It's going to be Rome. going to be part Roman rulership. Oh, you want Caesar? I'll give you Caesar. Then delivered he him, therefore, unto them to be crucified. And they took Jesus and led him away, bearing his cross. So Simon had part in the cross, and Jesus had part of the cross. Went forth unto the place called the place of the skull, which is called in the Hebrew, Gagatha. So, to finish the way to the cross, well, to, the Gagatha, Calvary, Jesus carried the cross. To start the, 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 the parade, will you, Simon, by where all the people were, as they got closer and closer, Jesus was giving the cross. I want you to notice tonight, we're done. I want you to notice tonight that your Baptist church, your religious churches, and Hollywood are wrong. With a side note, you, you put that, that, that robe, that piece of cloth on the cross. In all actuality, we're going to learn is Jesus was stark naked. On that cross. And the garments they had on Jesus were given away. When you put that robe, that, that scarlet or that purple on the cross and fashion your church with that stuff, you are Roman. And you're Catholic. 